Using various models and graphs, we will find out what the maximum area is for a rectangle using the perimeter of 32 toothpicks. This is the graph for different perimeters and toothpicks. Now we will make models of rectangles using each toothpick. <laughs> eight, 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 16, 24, five, 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 The maximum area for a rectangle with a perimeter of 32 meters is 64 meters squared, the highlighted line. The shape takes on a special rectangle, which is a square. The prediction for the dimensions of a rectangle with a perimeter of 40 meters that would have a maximum area would have a width equals 10 and length equals 10. Looking at the chart, the hypothesis is correct. You can predict the dimensions of a rectangle with maximum area if you know the perimeter by choosing the largest length and width. This would take on the shape of a square, which is considered a special rectangle. For a rectangle with maximum area made of 60 toothpicks, my prediction would be the rectangle with, with a width of 10 and the length of 20. Again, the maximum area is based on the largest width and length of the rectangle. However, it is not a square shape. The method to use the largest width and length, that is, usually a rectangle shape of a square, to determine the maximum area does not work in this case. The maximum area in this case is 56 meters squared, where a width of 7 and a, a length of 8, or a width of 8 and a length of 7, equals 56 meters squared and a perimeter of 30.